All right, so in this problem, I have x to the power of x is equal to 3 to the power of 2x plus 27. So to solve this, if I have something in the form a to the power of m plus n, this is equal to a to the power of m times a to the power of n. So 3 to the power of 2x plus 7, that's going to equal 3 to the power of 2x times 3 to the power of 27. Now, I'm going to divide both sides by 3 to the power of 2x. So then these two cancel out, and I get x to the power of x over 3 to the power of 2x is equal to 3 to the power of 27. Now, this is the same thing as 3 to the power of 2 to the power of x. Because remember, if I have something from a to the power of m times n, this is equal to a to the power of m to the power of n. And now, I can rewrite this as x over 3 squared to the power of x whole squared. So because both of these powers are to the power of x, I can just make it a whole square of the power of x. And this is still equal to 3 to the power of 27. Now, I'm going to take the power of 1 over 9 on both sides. So I get x over 3 squared, which we can rewrite as 9, to the power of x, to the power of 1 over 9 is equal to 3 to the power of 27 to the power of 1 over 9. And if I have something in the form a to the power of m to the power of n, this is equal to a to the power of m times n. So x over 9 to the power of x to the power of 1 over 9 is equal to x over 9 to the power of x times 1 over 9, which is equal to 3 to the power of 27 times 1 over 9. Now x times 1 over 9 is x over 9, so I get x over 9 to the power of x over 9 is equal to 3 to the power of 27 times 1 over 9, which is 3. And now if something is in the form a to the power of a is equal to b to the power of b, this means that a is equal to b. So in this case, x over 9 is equal to 3. And if I multiply both sides by 9, these two cancel out, and I get x is equal to 3 times 9, which is 27. So now to check, my original equation was x to the power of x is equal to 3 to the power of 2x plus 27. And x is equal to 27. So I get 27 to the power of 27 is equal to 3 to the power of 2 times 27 plus 27. And this is the same thing as 27 to the power of 27 is equal to 3 to the power of 54 plus 27, which is equal to 81. Now, 27 is the same thing as 3 to the power of 3, so I get 3 to the power of 3 times 27, which is equal to 3 to the power of 81. So I get 3 to the power of 81 is equal to 3 to the power of 81.